morning guys so we've just come to the park and it's like 10 o'clock in the morning um i just wanted to come and talk to you about my new plan of attack towards the raugus challenge um i've been finding it pretty hard i think i've pretty much put myself off blended bananas that's absolutely one thing i know for sure so i had a smoothie this morning which was 100 grams of blueberries 40 grams of oats and then some water and I blended that all up and then just ate three bananas after I drunk that so I just can't face blending the bananas at all just it turns me really sick makes me feel disgusting so and then I had my cup of tea this morning so I was having a good chat with Bryony last night from Queen Bee's Vegan TV and she's like how are you all finding your first week and I was like to be honest I feel like absolute crap my energy levels are at an all-time low my skin is acting out it is the worst it's been in a very long time to the point where I've actually stopped wearing makeup so I'm not wearing any makeup today and it's just I'm going out this evening, we've got an art show and um, I'm going to be wearing makeup then so I thought I'd just let my skin breathe for the whole day for as long as possible really. So I've, yeah, like after I have it, like I've been trying out like different recipes in the evening and like I've been really excited about it, like I've wholeheartedly gone into this challenge expecting to feel amazing. But I've just got to remember that like I am right at the beginning of my vegan journey also. So I think I was only fully vegan for maybe a week, if even that, prior to going into this fully raw challenge. So I think to myself and Bryony have come to the conclusion that um, my body's going through its detox stage at the moment. And... it probably was a bit brave and eager of me to do raugus right at the beginning of becoming a vegan um so yeah this week i'm going to be doing raw till four so i'm going to be having a raw breakfast and a raw lunch but then i'm going to be just having like a normal cooked dinner like i what i was having before because it's the whole process is making me feel quite unhappy and disgusting bloated sick constipated um but yeah so this week i'm just gonna focus on raw breakfasts and lunches which are fine for me anyway like i can do the whole overnight oat thing or i can do like an ot type of smoothie in the morning that's fine with bananas and then just snack on fruit throughout the day which is what i would do on an all day to day basis like I know this sounds ridiculous but I used to have like one piece of fruit on the hour every hour um, before doing this anyway before I was even a vegan anyway do you know what I mean because like I'm on Weight Watchers and like I just like to keep myself topped up throughout the day and not feel hungry at any point so I'll continue to do stuff like that I'll either have like a salad or a fruit lunch and then just go back to maybe having like my vegetable stir fries with like tofu and stuff like that in the evening and maybe some like Linda McCartney sausages or veggie burgers but like the thing is I would like it's not changing a hell of a lot like I will I would have been having like a salad but with a vegetable burger like chopped up and mixed into it anyway so like the only thing that I'm changing is the vegetable burger so it's it's odd really and I do feel a bit gutted in a way because I have bought now um, a spiralizer and a blender but then again I didn't pay a lot for them and I suppose that they will come in handy in the future at some point like I would probably want to do spiralized courgettes again in the future but maybe just not like on a day-to-day -day basis and I want to do things like make my own um, hummus and stuff like that but like using chickpeas from a can doesn't count apparently that doesn't count as raw and I'm just not I know I'm not gonna go and buy a big massive bag of chickpeas and soak them overnight that's not really me I haven't got to that stage yet I'm so new 
into my vegan journey that I'm just not ready to do stuff like that yeah I still really haven't found my feet with being a vegan in terms of like eating so yeah that's what we're gonna do and then if I feel like I can continue and do a fully raw week after a week of raw till four then I will do that as well so yeah <clears throat> but we're just gonna enjoy a few moments up at the park <coughs> and um, we shall see you all later. Hey guys, long time no see. So it's now half past six in the evening. We've just had dinner and we're just getting ready to go out to the art show. Um, this is not what I had intended to wear in the slightest. I wanted to wear a more modest dress, but I got told just about an hour ago that I need to wear something red. Red is all I have, so thank goodness I actually still have these and I haven't decluttered them until January, otherwise I wouldn't have anything red to wear. And then obviously the only outfit that I would have to go with my only red item would be this. Or a dress, I put a dress on that's got like um like a zebra print bottom and because it's like uh, puffy here and I've lost quite a lot of weight recently, it it makes me look pregnant and I'm like... And um, we're not wearing that, thank you very much. So I'm ending up wearing an outfit which is a little bit on the risque side, but hey ho, dress to impress and all that majazzle. So this is what I wore to Lauren's hem party when I had to dress up as the groom, apart from the shoes that are gonna be different. And then obviously I've bashed on my red lippy, which I wore on Saturday night. So I ended up having that smeared all over my face. So yeah, I'll probably try and vlog when I get there. Um, but I'll see you all in a bit. So I've just come to sign off for the evening. I can't believe how shite I look. Um, yeah, had fun at the art exhibition, even though I was only there for like half an hour. So I thought that would be enough for Holly. And plus it was quite a small exhibition anyway, as you could see. But I hope you enjoyed what I showed you. And yeah, for dinner, let's just keep you updated on August. For dinner, I had, what did I have? I had... fried off onion, garlic and pepper in the frying pan with some fry light and peas and carrots and some Linda McCartney sausages, three Linda McCartney sausages which Holly didn't like in the end which is a shame and then I had all of that on top of like a massive bed of spinach so it was nice to have something cooked, oh and I had roasted butternut squash as well so that was nice. But yeah, so tomorrow I will be back on my salad for dinner because it's um, salad Wednesday before weigh day. But yeah, I feel human. I feel a lot better for having something a bit cooked. And then I've just chowed down um, some grapes for my, for my um, dessert, I suppose, which is something that I would have normally done. 
anyway so yeah see you all tomorrow morning bye